These reading passages are a guide for parents. They demonstrate the progression of text, book characteristics, and reading skills throughout the first grade. As shown in the two examples, there is a great difference between the reading at the start of first grade, consisting of a simple sentence, large print, bigger spaces between words, and pictures that support the words, compared to the end of first grade. With each reading level passage, there are examples of text, characteristics, and reading skills. This chart is an overview. It is organized into three stages, start of year, mid-year, and end of year. The first stage, start of year, sets a reading foundation. I highlighted in green the support of context picture support because when pictures match the print, pictures help kids make meaning that connects to print. Mid-year stage. End of year stage. In addition, reading skill teaching charts are included in this video for use in the different levels. We are now ready to view the progression of reading throughout the first grade based on needed growth in book characteristics and reading skills demonstrated in these reading passages. Reading sample passage level one beginning first grade shows four sentences. Ben has a dog, Ben has a cap, Ben has a mug, Ben has a box. They demonstrate the needed text characteristics. Each sentence is one line of print, has a repeated pattern, is large print with ample spaces, and provides supportive pictures. It also demonstrates the needed reading skills. All words begin and end in known consonants, and all words are either known sight words or known CVC words, consonant, vowel, consonant words. In passage level two, the text characteristics increase as the sentences demonstrate more words in each sentence, repeated patterns with a change at the end, and the reading skills continue building on previous skills. These are two reading skill teaching charts to teach CVC words, usually the first two months of first grade, and cite words throughout the year in sequence order. Both charts can be downloaded and they are great for the classroom and to send home to parents. In level three, text characteristics move from simple sentences to simple storylines with varied sentences structures with less use of or no repeated patterns, use of more punctuation as quotation marks, commas, and or question marks as shown in these sentences. In reading skills, more sight words are used and word endings as in the word snacks ending in s, going ending in ing, and played ending in ed. In level four, text characteristics include longer sentences, the language structure is changing, and more attention to print is needed from kids. In reading skills section, there is a larger use of sight words and knowledge of compound words and two syllable words. In sample five, text characteristics consist of more pages, more complex sentences and stories. Pictures begin to extend meaning that is for building comprehension. 
in reading skills, more sight words are used, and now words with consonant blends are used as well as CVC silent E words. This is a beginning consonant blend chart to teach kids beginning blends, and the second one is a teaching tool that is a 60 second short video introducing CVC E words. Beginning consonant blends chart. Teach kids that when you add silent E to a short vowel word, it becomes a long vowel word. Can becomes cane. Het becomes peat. Hit becomes kite. Hop becomes hope. Hub becomes cube. Now we're moving into mid first grade passages. Sample passage level six starts our second stage, mid-year. Text characteristics will begin to range in topics. Storylines will become more complex, often requiring background knowledge, story understanding, and picture support to help kids read unfamiliar words. Reading skills will include the use of long vowel patterns, and irregular verbs. These are two teaching charts. One is for long E patterns and the other is for teaching irregular verbs. This teaching chart is to show kids that the long E pattern can be IE, EA, EE, EE consonant E, and make the E sound, as in I E field, E A peach, E E jeep, and E E consonant E cheese. This chart is to show kids that some past tense for verbs are irregular drive, drove, buy, bought take, took, get, got, ride, rode, and see, saw. Lesson sample seven through eight, mid first grade. Text characteristics, longer sentences, increased level of decoding needed, problem solving, have kids make predictions. As in this example, ask kids, what do you think the plan is? And in reading skills, use of digraphs and beginning prefixes. This is a digraph chart, CH, SH, TH, and WH. This is a chart I use to introduce kids to prefixes with the word un showing them that it means not or opposite of. Moving on to the late first grade passages. With sample passage nine through 10, late first grade, continue text characteristics and teach the reading skills R controlled vowels and contractions. Teaching R controlled vowels and contractions. In this stage, the most important part of text characteristics is that kids need to sustain meaning over a longer text, and in reading skills, the use of more long vowel patterns and inflectional ending ly. With the long vowel patterns chart and the ly chart. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe, and as always, I will leave a link to all the teaching templates in the description section.